Alrighty, guys. Um, I'm back, I think. Um, it's been two months since I've last uploaded, like, an actual video. Uh, I was only planning to leave for, like, a week or two, and that became two months. And, uh, I guess I'm sorry for that, because, like, I had no control, really. So, uh, what happened was everything, pretty much. Uh, school decided to just bend me over. I had so much schoolwork, like, every single day. It was so stressful. Like, I was, like, pulling my hair out. I had no free time. Like, I was getting headaches every day, and I just did not have any time to record. On top of that, uh, I know I'm, like, super late to this situation, but VenomRB got banned from Ultimate Driving, and not long after that, Ford Mustang quit because of Venom's ban, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if that was the direct cause of it, but I know it probably kind of fueled his fire. A little while later, Venom plays RB, got banned off of not Roblox, but YouTube. I'm pretty sure that has to be done manually by somebody. But he was permanently banned from YouTube because he uploaded like commercials and stuff. I think that's the reason. I could be wrong, uh, but it was like copyright stuff. Y'all lost like four UD YouTubers in the span of a month. So uh, yes, I mean four, including me, because I quit UD. Uh, I just don't find the game appealing anymore. I just seriously don't. Like, I think that that game is more for kids than it is for, you know, a 15-year-old. So, I decided to just quit because, you know, I, it's just not fun anymore. It's boring. It's not necessarily, I mean, it's kind of the game's fault, not really. Because what they're trying to do, they're trying to shift more towards appealing to children. Because Roblox is mainly children. Like, most people, I guarantee you, who play Roblox are under the age of 13. Between the ages of like 8 and 13, I feel like that's like the main player base right there. Now there are people above and below that, but I feel like they wanted to kind of, you know, appeal to that audience instead of the older audience, which sure, they can do that, it's their game. But, you know, people like us who want just a regular, you know, driving game, not a children's game, we were kind of just left out. And every update that came out didn't really feel complete to us, if that makes sense. It just didn't feel right. So, a lot of people quit UD. And when I mean a lot, I mean like half of my friends list right now does not play the game anymore. Actually, probably more than half. I said like three-fourths of it. So, I was kind of getting bored of the game because, you know, everybody left. And, like, every server on UD was just dead. Like, every server I joined, there was nobody talking. And not only that, but like, um, I don't know why, but not long before Venom Arby's ban, I was actually fearing myself of getting banned for no apparent reason. Uh, I honestly don't know why I would fear of getting banned. I've literally done nothing, so uh, I was just fearing for no reason because I want to spend all my money in the game before I quit, which is what I'm going to be doing. I'm spending all of my money on all the cars in the game right before I quit. That's going to be my last UD video. Uh, I was originally going to be doing a stream, but I posted a poll in the Discord and video won by a pretty decent margin, so we'll be doing a video. But yeah, I'm going to be spending like $100 million. It's going to be great. But yeah. Yeah, back to why I quit UD. The updates, they're just subpar. Like, I mean, I haven't actually played the most recent update yet. I don't know how it is, but uh, I'm not going to judge it because I haven't even hardly played it yet. So I'm not going to like give opinions on that. But prior to that update, like the rally update, they added like two rally cars and they added like checkpoints. That's barely, barely a rally update. If they wanted to make like a whole like rally update, they would have added like 10 cars. They would have like, I don't know, maybe even made a new map. That's what they need to do. They need to stop focusing on Westover and start focusing on other maps. Like, uh, I'm pretty sure Ford Mustang was talking about this, but like, is it Fontana Dams, how you say it? I never really got into that map, but it is a good map. I've, I've played it before. Um, people were upset because I guess the development of that game just stopped and nobody's been working on it ever since. But yeah, I feel like the maps were kind of ruined by the terrain. I don't like that terrain. I don't know what people are talking about when they're like, oh yeah, the terrain's great. Like, it's not. It really isn't. Like, it kills FPS. Before the terrain was added into UD, I was getting like 60 FPS all the time. I would very rarely go under 60 and go to like 50, but you know, and then right after the terrain got dropped, I was down to like 20 to 30. It was horrible. And people were saying, oh, it's not the terrain. Yes, it was the terrain. 
So I think that's like what really put me off the game because playing a game in 30 FPS is just terrible. It sucks. I hate playing games that like that are below 50 FPS. It just sucks. So yeah, don't think I quit UD because of like Venom Arby's ban. Uh, that honestly had no correlation as to why I quit UD. But um, the, probably the main reason why I quit is just because the game isn't appealing. So I'm going to go ahead and say this. I'm not deleting the channel. I'm keeping the channel up and running, but I'm going to be rebranding it. I'm going to be playing other games such as like Steam games, I'll be playing those. Uh, I'll be playing maybe Driving Empire. Uh, I posted a poll and you guys seem to really like Driving Empire. So uh, we'll be switching up content. We'll also be doing more Peachberry videos too. So like more streams and stuff. So uh, we are currently working on a brand new map for Peachberry, uh, Peachberry version four. Unlike the previous three uh, Peachberry maps, I'm actually getting help building the map uh, thanks to AMD. And not only that, but Kev said he would uh, help build an interstate. By the way, if you don't know who AMD is, he's actually kind of new to the Peachberry team. So uh, he's been helping out a lot lately. And Kev is uh, the Army Boys. I'm sure you know who he is. So they have decided to help with Peachberry's map, and they've been doing a pretty good job. So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing um, after I quit UD. But I got to make the video where I spend all my money first, of course. And then I'm also going to be doing a lot more streams. So I want to kind of do streams on a like weekly basis, maybe. I'll see how that goes, but I want to stream a lot more. So um, I think that's about it. But uh, to all of the Ultimate Driving YouTubers and to all the Ultimate Driving players, um, I wish you guys good luck. Uh, I don't think the game's going to get any better. Uh, I might come back after the trucker update if it's good. So uh, I guess that's about it. So uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later.